I heard about Reach from Mark Hicks and from my brother Emmett, uh, it just sounded like such an extraordinary way to have the university reach into the community and make a difference. A lot of the kids are not exposed to college as early as some of their communities might be. Uh, and it was just a great opportunity to, to really share some of my experiences, hoping that they would be relevant to some of them. Well, the connection is that I'm from that neighborhood too, and uh, there's no difference. There's not a difference between what they're doing and who they are and who I am, and uh, we're all part of the same community. And I think to let them know that anything's possible. Anybody can work hard, and if you work hard, people are noticing. They're seeing that you're working hard. They're motivated to help you. They're motivated to support you. If you do that, people will come. They, uh, it's almost if you build it, they will come. If you work hard, people will come. I do feel a connectedness to the kids who go to school here or are thinking about going to school here, and I want to be connected to to all kids who want to do more. And I say what they, I said to them, what I say to my own children, and that is, if you work hard, you'll get what you want to get. I mean, you don't have to have the plan figured out now, but in the meantime, work hard, do well in school, prepare yourself for the opportunity that is coming down the road. You don't have to know what that opportunity is today. It's coming. But if you work hard and you do well in a program like this, you're going to be able to take advantage of it. Every school is different, and uh, what Yale views as its community may not be exactly what Laverne views as its, its, its uh, community or its constituency, um, but, the, re, but the, the, the similarities are that they are both change agents and, and education institutions, educational institutions are known to be organizations that can really cause things to happen. So whether it's in New Haven or whether it's in, in Pomona or Laverne or the Inland Empire, it really doesn't make a difference. Both Yale and Laverne are doing the same things and they're enlightening young people to, to reach beyond what they thought uh, they might be able to do into something greater. And I, given that we're going to be supported by all these great minds in the future, it's important that on either coast, at any university, that everybody's doing everything they can to, to uh, support that goal. I guess I would say to all of the students, whether it's the class at REACH or to the Laverne College students, don't get too locked into the conventional wisdom about what others can do and what you can do. Break through. As I said to you, society tends to want to lump us in boxes for convenience. It's easier to do that, and part of the challenge is, is breaking out of the box and being the person that you want to be. Whether it's a different community, whether it's a different lifestyle, it doesn't matter. It's pursuing your own dreams and having the tools to, uh, to execute on those dreams. So I think that's what I really want to get through today is that you can do it all, uh, but you have to work to be able to earn this, the opportunity to do it.